Hi guys, welcome to another episode of the Growth Hacking video series. Today I'm going to be showing you how to create a business manager account, how to create an ad account, and how to fund your ad account with your Naira MasterCard. It is important to know that if you have a Facebook account, okay, you automatically have access to the Facebook business manager platform. With the Facebook business manager platform, you can manage your pages, you can manage the people that work on your pages, you can manage your ad accounts, everything in one place. So I'll take it that you have a Facebook account and we're just going to log in. Okay, so log in. Now this is what, this is what the Facebook business manager platform looks like. Okay, now um, I'm going to show you how to create an ad account. Okay, the ad account enables you to run Facebook adverts on your page. And with the Facebook ad account that I'm going to be showing you, you can fund it. It's like a wallet. You can fund it with your Naira MasterCard and then you can use it to run adverts on your Facebook page. So let me show you how to create an ad account. So now we've seen how to create a business manager account. Let's move to the ad account. So once you've logged in, this is how your dashboard is going to look like. Mine is looking like this because I've added some pages. And once you click on business settings, it takes you to another tab. And then here, just by the left, you see pages here you can uh, add pages and just search for the page and then add it but well, we are trying to open an ad account so i'm going to click on add account and you will see the button here that says add you have add an ad account request access to an ad account or create a new ad account which is what we are trying to do okay so i'm going to click on this it is very very easy the ad account helps you um fund your account with naira in the past people always pay for their adverts in dollars or in some certain currency right and sometimes it's usually not successful and then you end up owing facebook some money okay but by creating an ad account from the Facebook Business Manager platform, you can create as many ad accounts in different currencies. Maybe today you are in Nigeria and um, you're running adverts in Nigeria. Of course, you need to have an ad account that enables Naira option. Tomorrow, you travel to another country, let's say China, for example and then you want to run your adverts in the Chinese currency, you need to create an ad account that accepts Chinese payments. So here it is. You need to give your ad account a name. Um, it could be the name of your business. It could be the name of your brand. So I'm just going to say Nature's Touch Beauty Brand as an example, okay? My time zone is Africa, Lagos, and my currency is already in Nigerian Naira. But eventually, I want to change it. Maybe I'm somewhere else, for example. Maybe I'm in um, um, UK, for instance. I'm going to pick this. Maybe I'm in a European country. I'm going to pick this. So it's important for us to know that from the ad account, you can create it with your, your current um, currency the residence where you are the, the currency that is being used so which makes it easy right so that is one of the um important things about using an ad account from the facebook business manager it's, it's, it makes things a lot easier you don't have to go to the normal facebook page and impute your card and then facebook automatically removes money from your card which sometimes is not always successful because then they are charging you in dollars you know so that's why it's important to have a a a, a facebook um, ad account for your advert so i'm just going to click on next it's showing no payment methods available 
but I'm gonna set it up and I'm gonna show you how to do that. So I'm just gonna click on next. So yes, it's been created. I need to set permissions for myself, of course. I'm gonna click this. then assign and the ad account has been created this is the ad account that has been created this is the one i've previously used and this is the one that i just recently created okay so i'm going to click on it so now we've seen how to create an ad account the most important aspect is funding your ad account let's watch all right so coming to my right there's a drop down and i'm going to click on view payment methods now that i have created my ad account you see it's very easy this is where you you'd click when you want to create a new ad account okay then i want to set my payment method now i have created my ad account that accepts naira payments so i want to set it up i want to fund my ad account so let's go Yes, so this is what my ad account looks like. This is my, like an example, my wallet. Okay, you can see that the amount due is zero naira and it's a naira. Yeah, now I want to add a payment method. So please, this is where you really, really need to pay attention. I'm going to click here. We have credits or debit card and then we have Facebook coupon. Please do not mistake credit or debit card as um, your normal Naira Mastercard. Okay, it's not the same. If you try to impute your details here, payment is not going to go through. Okay, so this is not what we're looking for. We're looking for the option that says Naira Mastercard. So I'm not going to click on continue. I'm just going to cancel it and then click on add payment method again. And I'm sure by the time I click on it, I'm going to see the option that says Naira Mastercard. And there we have it. We have credit or debit card. We have bank transfer. We have Naira payment with Mastercard forward slash Visa. We don't have businesses with this too, trust me. So don't complicate things. This is where you need to go. Naira payments with MasterCard. So if you have a GT Bank, MasterCard, you have Zenit, you have um, Access, whatever card that is, whatever MasterCard you have that, as, uh, uh, that allows online payments should work for this. So I'm going to click on continue. Remember, we're trying to fund the ad accounts that I just created. Okay, we want to put money inside so that we can use it to run adverts on the Facebook page. Okay. One amazing thing about this ad account that allows you to just you know, fund it, just put money inside and then you know you keep your card, is that you never have to pay more than what you've put inside. For eventually, you want to put two thousand naira in this ad account until the two thousand naira finishes before you add money again. So Facebook doesn't need to automatically deduct anything. You're just putting money in like a wallet. When that money finishes, you put in money again, okay? And then it's Facebook, right? Your um, payment information are stored accurately and it's very, very secure. I've been using this. As a matter of fact, this is what I recommend that you use. You don't need to go to the normal Facebook page and start putting your card there and then automatically they'll be deducting your money no this is the right way to go okay so i'm going to click on continue yes now you adjust the payment here maybe i want to put ten thousand naira yes this is ten thousand naira i'm going to click on ensure that <laughs> ensure the amount you're putting is correct don't do mistake and put 200,000 well it depends if you want to put 100,000 it's fine if that's the amount you want to use for your account but just ensure that the amount you're putting is correct okay so I'm, I'm going to click on review payments yes so 10,000 it is and then I'm going to click on make payment so it's going to take you to 
a gateway a payment gateway facebook has a very secure payment gateway where you're going to impute your card details and um when you get your otp or if you have um your token you can use it so you see this is the payment gateway that facebook uses and um it's uh it's this is a payment gateway that processes payments on behalf of facebook okay so ready i'm gonna click on continue yes so this is it now this is where you will put your card details okay you put your card details your card number your card holder name expiry dates and you know the necessary information and when you do when you click on pay when you click on this then it takes you let's say for example you're using the gtb mastercard you impute your gtb number here your your your, your name the expiry dates and then the year and when you click on this pay ten thousand, it takes you to the gt payment gateway so you see these are processes and they're very very secure i've just shown you what you can do all by yourself it's simple easy you click on this pay ten thousand, then it takes you to the gt bank um, payment gateway you input your otp or your token and then automatically after like two three seconds you know your payments would show in your ad account all right so i'm just going to cancel this because i'm not ready to pay ten thousand <laughs> yeah back so once you've followed the process okay you followed everything you, you you are careful once you've done that automatically this here that shows 0, 0.00 naira will become ten thousand Okay, let's look at the ad payment method again. See, this is where we're going to Naira payment with MasterCard. Then you click on continue and you impute. You remember, this is what I previously put. So that's Facebook for you. You know, the previous amount you paid will just come up. Assuming you want, that's what you want to keep paying, but then you can always adjust it. And I can put like maybe 2,500. 2500 review payments and follow instructions and then voila your ad account has some money inside okay remember that it's super easy let's take it from the top so from here to add an ad account this is like this is what i the ad account I created, remember, but let's say you want to create another one, okay? So just come to business settings, business settings. You need to come to add account. This is add account, okay? And this is the one I previously created that we, we did. Then I want to add another one, create a new ad account. Okay. okay, includes the name of your business. For instance, ensure that your currency is in Naira. Please ensure your currency is in Naira. Okay, you go back, go down, and ensure it is in Naira. Okay, mine is automatic because the ad accounts are in creating or in naira okay but yours might not immediately pick naira so you need to scroll down and ensure it's in naira and then next and then you know you follow the instructions and then you're good to go and then once you've done that you come here this drop down shows you what you need to do next you payment methods zero naira because there's nothing there add money naira payment with mastercard continue and then you're good to go so now that you've added money to your ad account how then do we use the money to run an advert let's see now for example we want to boost this post i'm just going to click on boost post you know we're back to the normal facebook right we've left 
um, Facebook business manager we're back to the normal Facebook okay now um, let us assume that every information here is correct you want to make payments yeah remember that you need to select your ad account all right ignore this this used to be an old account this is the one that i use currently and this is the one we created okay now i'm going to click on it and then it is showing my available balance as zero naira if we had gone ahead to make the ten thousand naira payment it will reflect here it would show that this is my available balance and with this information I can run my advert. I can say, okay, because I have ten thousand naira in my ad account, let me run the ad. ad, ad let me run this advert for like maybe one thousand five hundred. Then I'm going to spread it to like say seven days. You know, so the ad accounts is a a, a way that you can ignore all these um, accounts you used to use that has you know different currencies. Okay, this is the one we recently created, Nature's Touch Beauty brand. And um, assuming you follow these steps, this is how you're gonna run your advert. So you don't need to input your card details on Facebook platform itself and then just store your card details and Facebook would deduct the money um, automatically. No. From the Facebook business manager platform, you create your ad account, you come back to your normal Facebook, click on the post you want to boost, you scroll down. Of course, you fill in the information, your audience and everything, and then you just come down. Then you come, this is where we, we, we need to focus on the payment. So you click on this and select the ad account you created and funded, okay? If you had funded the account with substantial amount, it will show here available balance this. Then from the available balance, you now run your adverts and create a budget. Okay, so I hope we've been able to understand how to um, access the Facebook Business Manager and how to create an ad account and most importantly, how to fund it. Ensure you practice these steps with the laptop, it's easy, create your ad account, fund it, go back to your normal Facebook page. Remember that you run adverts on page, okay? Go back to your normal Facebook page, click on the post you want to boost, fill in the information, set your audience and all of that, scroll down to payment and select the ad account you created and funded and then you're good to go so guys until next time see you at the top bye bye now we've learned how to fund our ad accounts with the naira mastercard i believe that you've gotten value from this training if yes please subscribe to our youtube channel and share this video to as many prospects as possible i wish you all a successful advert on facebook Keep winning and see you at the top. Bye bye.